a fashion designer, fashion entrepreneur. I'm all about, you know, empowering women, empowering girls to achieve their dreams. I thank God for giving me a talent, but not only even just giving me a talent, but for me discovering it at a very young age. I'm just trying to find a way to start, you know, promoting Made in Rwanda and then also, yeah, making SM a global brand. But I'm also, I'm a graphic designer. I did visual communication and graphic design. I just felt that I was destined to be a fashion person, not a designer, but maybe a fashion editor. The fashion industry in Rwanda is really growing. The fact that we're creating brand stories differentiate our brands. And so where someone can see someone in the street, they're like, that is Sonia Mokabo. And that's what I'm trying to do every day. Working with people like to do the same things. People think it has to be competition, negative competition. But for me, I'm like, no, I have my own design aesthetics. I am working with people who have the same vision as me and trying to show that, you know, I'm a team player. If Forbes can recognize me as one of, you know, 30 young Africans who have the potential to have uh, successful uh, businesses, that shows that I'm doing the right thing, I'm on the right track, and I, that motivates me to keep going. I persevere because I know what I want and I have a vision. One thing people don't actually know is I use florals because we have a lot of flowers in Rwanda. It's an exciting time to be Rwandan. I'm so proud of my country, so proud of my president. It's amazing to be a woman today in Rwanda and just seeing how, you know, with so much darkness comes so much light. My name is Sonia Mugawo and this is Rwanda Next.